What? What's going on? How am I in a t-shirt? And I'm outside here for more than like five seconds. Bro, what's up? What the hell's going on? What is up? Where's the snow? I'm tripping out here. JK, what's going on guys? It's your boy Lil Nightcat bringing you a brand new vlog. And I hope you all are having an amazing day. I know I had a beautiful day. Great time with my friends. And right now, it's about like 70 freaking degrees out here. I'm at my place. I'm, no, I'm not in California. I'm not in Florida. I'm not in the Caribbean yet. But we're just chilling right here in Pennsylvania. And it's about 70 degrees. In April. 2018. Like, what? It is such a beautiful day, once again. But thank you, weather, for giving us this. Whew. I really respect it. The weather is God for this, honestly. But, yeah, later on, Kyle and I are about to go swimming tonight. So we might be able to record a couple behind the scenes from that. Yeah, I don't know if they're really going to allow filming in there. But we're about to go to Roy's first before that. And then we're probably going to hit up Walmart, the Kmart Plaza, Maybe some places in Milford. We're definitely going to sit down in front of Milford and check out who we can see if any of our pals are there. Because, you know, we're always finding our friends there. So I hope any of you guys want to come through, just make sure you have me on my Instagram and my Snapchat to meet up. Anyone's allowed to be in the vlogs. So just once again, you got to appreciate this because next week it is actually going to be like in the 30s yet again. Sad, sad. Like this is only going to be the, the weekend miracle basically. And it's not April 1st, so this isn't a prank or anything. But let's get this moving on. I actually had to just make some lunch. My mom's heating up some rice for me, so I don't have to spend any money at Roy Rogers because you guys know before summertime, I don't have a job right now. During the summer, I'm going to be working. But as of right now, I don't have a job, so i got to watch the money. I can't be like spending even small money. I have to be careful with to make sure that everything stays well. But it's all good. We know the plan. Stay to the plan. Follow your goals. Let's get going. I'm on my balcony right now, by the way, at my bedroom. Just for the third time. Thank you, weather. Tell me how in God's name is that possible. What? What the heck? That's... I never thought I'd see that again. <laughs> right. Right. We got the uh, surprise hurry-up meal from my beautiful mother. Right? Thank you. How's your day? Great, very good. It's Friday. You can always make it through a Friday. Facts. Be a mama like the wind and the rain, right? Be a mama like a southbound train. Hey, mama rock me. So we just made it to Roy Rogers. We're out here just kind of gonna eat some food. Yo, what'd you get? Your mac and cheese? Mm -hmm. You guys, mac and cheese? I got mac and cheese this time. Fried sandwich. Best food in the world. Come to Roy Rogers if you want some good stuff. He actually contributed and helped me. He bought me the bacon cheeseburger that I love from here. Oh my god, it is delicious. So our plan is we're gonna actually. Are we getting gas after this? We're either gonna go get gas or we're gonna head to the pool. Oh, having no gas to get to the pool. To the pool. Yeah. I'm gonna so make sure I've been We're actually game. finding out because there's like a sport game going on at the high school, and a lot of our friends are there, so we might actually show up there too. No. We should. Well, yeah, but no, I don't know about. Got like a lot of friends there. there. All right, so the food was freaking delicious. Thanks to my man once again for complimenting me a bacon cheeseburger. He's enjoying his, man. You know what? We deserve this. It's been a long week of hard work. School's really tough, but we get through it. We're almost done. This man's almost graduated, right? You, you could do it. You got two months. <laughs> really, the, the effort that my best friend Kyle puts into school and all the stuff he does, like helping his parents. I tried to do that. Every keeping that's that kind of Keeping a good truck. Managing his money. Like... You guys should comment down below right now. Thank you, Kyle. Thank you, Iceman. Future U.S. Army. You already know what's up. This man works really hard. All right, so we just came to, like, a lacrosse game. We didn't know what the hell was going on. But, yeah, we did see the people we 
we're expecting we're going to be here because they love sports. So, yeah, pretty good day, honestly. The last time I was here, it was freezing and marching then. I used to record from right there. Those were great times. I can't uh, wait for next year's marching band season. I got a belly. You got a belly? Yeah, I got one too. But we're actually going to go swimming soon. We just wanted to see. Nothing too much going on in the field. The game just it, ended. Yeah. It ended, so it's not worth. But. Dude, I do look like a hippie. That's right. Wait, you're a hippie? Oh, my God. No. What? No, guys, no. Kyle. Guys, come. All no. right, Kyle's a hippie. No. Buzz it! Exposed! No, no, no. Just the way. The shorts. Nah, yeah, man. I mean, I don't, cover my I don't even wear shorts. I'm wearing, like, sweats. I don't wear shorts anymore. That's not really my, uh. My sense of style, but you be you, honestly. Let's go. I don't get why right. these people are We're, we're about to, we gotta go swimming right now. Let's go swimming. Heading to the pool. Alright, guys, so we just went for a good swim. That was awesome, right? Oh, yeah. We really needed awesome. it. It was really refreshing. Got my head, got my kickstart so I could stay up all night long. But actually, we're gonna go to Walmart and he's gonna get beef jerky. I'm not gonna get anything. Then we might hit up Mickey D's, we might hit up the Kmart Plaza, you know, I probably went over this in the beginning. But, the field. Yo, deadass right now, the field is dark as shit. That, that's pretty scary. But, dude, I look like I have short hair because my hair is wet, and I'm wearing the hat. But, as soon as it dries, it's like everywhere. So, Kyle is reading some Snapchats, reading some stories up. Add him, K. Hordazinski at... My snap is N for lens of five. Here, come here. Come we had people back. Okay, Alright, we're gonna we're gonna take some pictures. This looks really sketchy. If you didn't know, it's Friday the thirteenth. And I don't know, maybe uh Jason Voorhees is gonna come out of nowhere and try to kill us. Yeah. That's okay. Right? Yeah, we're gonna die. Yeah. We'll die. We're gonna die. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, God. We lived a good life. Ah uh, yeah, we did. We got it. We got it. We got our money's worth for the long run. <laughs> yeah. Dude, I've never been here like on like this alone at the school though. All right, so, yeah, we're walking to Walmart right now. We decided that we want to save a little bit of money, you know. On gas, so I don't, I can't really use, use our legs. Even though it's Friday the thirteenth and we're walking around in the dark, it's probably gonna get kind of bad. <laughs> we're about to pass like an eighteen wheeler. Blasting the rock, yo, we're blasting uh, the Rocky theme. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Let's hit the Wally World. We got the 18 wheelers over here. People's personal trailers that they kind of like live here, I guess. It's weird. But when I stay after school and I go to McDonald's, we always walk across here because there's McD's right over there. It's a lot of fun. I love all my friends. You guys are the best. They always say, you ride with the ones who was there from the start. That is a true fact. But you always meet new people along the way that you gotta respect. Ow. Yeah. Hey, a light. Yeah. Hey, stupid yeah. light. Yeah, yeah, we're in Walmart right now. Technically, I can, but He I just had to get the monster and the jack links. Because you know it's the best stuff in the world. So. So, right now, what do you want to. Where are we going? I don't know. Wanna go to so, McDonald's? No. Go back there and then drive there or something? Mm -hmm. or, you know, you wanna go to the Kmart Plaza? This hotel crush here still open? Oh, yo, that would be a better idea, guys. Because we, we've been meaning still, to get still, you. It's a beautiful night, and I figured yeah, it'll be it's going to get cold again after this, so we might as might well go as to well enjoy it while, while it lasts. lasts. Then we'll head to hotel Oh, it's right there. Um, it's going to be fun. It's, this night's I'll not over yet. I'll just get gas, and I turn to the hill because I have the card. So, yeah, that's what it's like at Walmart at, like, 10 p.m. All right, we're going back to Kyle's truck right now. We're gonna make our way to the hotel. We got these 18 wheelers. Electric shift. That's our school. Pretty good school, I have to say. Whoa, dude! I just slipped on that. That was like a ditch. Yeah. Watch out! Let's hit track the trailer. Yeah. Yeah. I guess they drive. That's that's really odd. You know why? Let me tell you why they do that. You know, during that storm, I might have had. Oh yeah, yeah. When the, there. when there was a lot of snow here, I think look, this was like their shelter. Your, look, this was shelter. Yeah. Yes, it was. Walmart was shelter. 
They had that open at like five in the morning for people to go. My in. dad had to sleep in the Key Foods parking lot, guys. This was a very during the storm. Like I want to make hold up. I want to make a really good like behind the scenes telling of how how it was because I was only able to record and upload so many videos because I had to help my family, help my neighbors snowblow a lot of yards and stuff. And I want to make like a video or a couple videos even because it, it's a lot of stuff that we went through during this that was, storm. That was one of the baddest things it was ever. brutal as fuck. Like, and, it caused, and, it, and it caused just as much as Sandy to recover from the storm. And it did hurt. Yeah, hey, somebody too. just blew an air horn over there. <laughs> yeah, but like I got it. That's something I got to make and tell all the stories of how we survived. Like we didn't have the power. There was a lot of snow, <laughs> a lot of snow blowing, a lot of. No fridge, no flush in the toilet. Like it was, it was a bitch. Let me tell you. But we yeah, were so able. We, to the bathroom we overcame. We overcame. And that's yeah, that's what matters. Americans always overcome, my man. Hey, we gotta get gas. What's going on, man? I'm tired. <laughs> One day. Yeah, we like, work, we've been working hard. <laughs> oh my god! I no shout out! I have been coke this tire in a long time, you can tell in my voice. How do you how do you think this truck runs on gas? Good? Bad? Decent. Gets 18 and said each one in one highway. Dang. This is why I got this two on top. It's the best shit in the world. Read that right there. Already got some gas. Smells right. Dude, are you good? I'm fine to drive. Don't worry about that. It's just. Alright, man. Like, it's just been a long week. I think because I'm studying so much and not used to it, then I'm tired from studying. You know what I mean? Mm hmm. Yeah. Just it has not, been a long week for us. I'm and just this not man, used he's to He's studying for his study. ass, man. You're gonna do good, man. You really are. We just made it to the fresh air. My boy Kyle, best parallel parker in the world. That is a perfect parallel parking. I think you can get. Like seriously, get Kyle to teach you some lessons on that right here. Let Twenty bucks an hour. Oh yeah, that's perfect. That's like right in there. Look at that, man. Yo, so I'm here to talk about one major subject that basically has been in my mind for a while. Is that I want to say a thank you and appreciation for all the friends that I've made this year because this school year honestly has been the year that I've been very open. In the past, I've been very, like when I was younger, I was a very shy person. Like I was really like close into myself. And I really, I wouldn't branch out and get to know people that well, but dude, 11th grade honestly has been the year about me just meeting people, making friends, just experiencing a lot of new things that I've never experienced before. Like it's all gonna get better. Basically, I would never picture myself with a, a good friend like Kyle doing stuff like hanging out at a, uh, just some doing this. Like, I wouldn't be doing stuff like this if, if I didn't open up my own self to make new friends. And that's, this is basically a, to all my friends, anyone that I've met since I've been a more open person to people. Thank you, thank you for being there. You, every person that I meet, impacts me in some way, in some way, whether it's good or if I meet people that are in terms of like not positive people, that, that also impacts me. Every single person, everything that I do impacts me in some way. Like you know, you know what I'm saying? That all the positive people I've met lately have impacted me. They've helped me change the way I think of life and how much more like positive and open I am to it and I'm surprised. I don't. I don't know why I don't make more videos like this, talking because I can go on like this all night long. Honestly, right? You've seen some of our conversations. What we talk about, dude. I don't film everything, but damn. If you ever want to have a conversation with two crazy people, it's me and Kyle. You can. Have, we could talk about anything with you guys. Just hit us up in the comments. You know what's up. But I hope you're all having a wonderful day. So this is like, once again, thank thank you to everyone that I've come across since I've been a more like positive, outgoing person to any person that I come across just to show my respect for all people in the world, you know?
because that's that's the only thing you can do. Is just be yourself, and people. Pe some people aren't gonna accept you for who you are. You have to understand that, and you know what? You know what we gotta do? The people that if they don't respect you for who you truly are, fuck that. The people that you should continue to seek a friendship and a relationship with are the ones that respect you for who you truly are. If someone doesn't respect you and gives you shit about who you're trying to be, they're not they're not right for you. And that's just coming from a long, like, through my life I've learned this, is that you should ride with the ones that are riding with you. I'm sorry, guys, for the background music. This is just me relaxing and... So... Don't worry about it. Just listen to Nate. It's all, it's all good. Kyle loves me. This, this man doesn't... This man loves history music. But... Back to what I was saying, I don't mean to get off track, by the way. Is that... You have a better... A better chance of being happy yourself... If you rock with people that are willing to rock with you for who you are. And that's no disrespect to anyone. That's just... I needed to say that. But thank you to all you guys that are watching. Most importantly, I love you. Thank you for watching every one of my videos. You matter more than ever. And... It's, it's a blessing to even just have a small YouTube channel. I don't care. I'm not doing this for money. I'm not doing this for fame. I just It just makes me happy, honestly, to do YouTube videos. But once again, just stay, love your, respect. Yeah, no, no, don't, don't not like me because of my music. It's just me. This is relaxing, venting, and just, just, you know. Lining off some steam, that's all. There's no music that you guys need to worry about. It's all good, guys. Just, just take that with a grain of salt. But I don't need to keep getting sidetracked. The people that matter most to me are my family, my friends, and you guys. You know what? No. You guys are my friends. I have friends that I, that I know and some friends that... I guess watch my videos that I don't know that well, but I'd love to get to know you well. All you gotta do is just comment down below, and hey, I'm, I'm always open to meeting new people. Just, that's it, man. Just, and what I've just said, no disrespect to anyone, you be who you want to be. That's one thing. You gotta be what you want to be. No one's gonna, no one, never be afraid to be what you want to be. What you really want to be. Just be that person. And if people don't respect you for being that person, then that's their problem, honestly. And they're that's only going to ruin them inside. You're going to rise above them. And you're going to be like, hi, I'm, I did. I stuck to what I wanted to do. And I fucking made it, man. But this is, this is really peaceful. From how nice it is right now. Just being able to come out here. And just relax. And just talk about all the great relationships that I've made in the past. Like, since 8th grade began. You know, not 8th grade, I mean 11th grade. I'm getting, uh, it's been a long week. I'm off, I'm off the kickstart right now. But it's just wonderful. Loving life. Just being myself. Being who I truly am. And once again, I love you guys so much. Thank you for always being there for me. Even if, even if there's not even a lot of people who see my videos. It, I, it, I appreciate it so much. I don't care. I, I don't want fame. I don't, I'm not thirsty for fame or anything, honestly. Just, I'm thirsty for a good life and good relationships. That's what I'm, that's what I crave. Just... Always meeting people when I get the chance. I feel like whenever I get the chance to make a new friend, it's, it's, I do it. I do it. I go up and I go up to the person and say, "What's going on, man? Nice to meet you." I love shaking hands with people. It's just a good thing. You say Life is wonderful, guys. Life is really wonderful. Alright guys, so I just got home and I'm pretty exhausted, so I gotta end the video off here. But one last thing I gotta say is once again, thank you so much for watching. I can't express that enough. I love all you guys so much. I just want to make sure that you guys stay positive, stay healthy, stay humble. Don't be someone you're not. Just be yourself no matter what goes on in your life. Just stay you and things will probably 
you know what, they will go your way. You have a better chance of doing good in life if you're you're just you. What you want to do, you follow your own dreams. And I will see you beautiful people tomorrow. Peace out, gang. Oh yeah, and one more thing. Happy 30th birthday to my dad. He's in Italy right now, but he's coming home tomorrow. I can't wait to see him again, so happy birthday, pops.